Hey there guys, this is another DC Universe Signature Collection review. Um, this one here is Mirror Master. Now I usually only do the box reviews um, because my son tends to do the actual action figure reviews so you know you can see lots of other people who have done really good reviews on the actual figures. Uh, I'd just like to talk about the one I've received. Um, I think Mattel have done quite a good job in general. Um, you know they've f actually given uh, Mirror Master as a character, you know his um, accessories, which is good. It's got his patches on the side, as you can see. You can put his uh, mirror guns, whatever they are, um, inside them, and he comes with whatever they are, the mirror grenade or whatever it is. Um, but I think it's nice that he's he comes with accessories. Most of their line does not. We'll just have a quick look at the box. So as you can see, signature collection. Um, you could only get these usually if you uh, subscribed or if you went on their website and just bought it outright. Um, I believe that this is actually a really good figure to get if you're um, a fan of the Flash as you can then start completing your uh, rogues gallery as I believe there's only two main villains that they've actually released. Um, I think one is Captain Boomerang as you all recall and the other being Captain Cold from Wave 7. I need the, uh, the Atom Smasher Wave, so anyway. Um, looking at this figure, it's pretty good, you know, standard mold. I would have preferred if it was the uh, more up-to-date recent version of uh, Mirror Master, as this particular version is the um, second Mir uh, Mirror Master, not the original. Um, I think the original was a physicist, and this particular one is using his gadgets. Well, um, if you want to know what the most latest one looks like, he is actually in the new um, Justice League cartoon, I think it's called Doomed, um, which is a combination of two storylines amalgamated into one, and is actually pulled off really, really well. So yeah, definitely you know, check it out. You'll see what I mean. Why uh, they should have like updated this character, but in general, he's pretty good. Um, m this particular version has a bit of uh, paint issues on the boot, um, around the cuff, and on the face mask itself. There's a, there's a little bit of bleeding here and there um, of the green. So mm, not entirely pleased, but as you if you want to know. Um, this figure comes with all the standard DCU articulation, which is a shame. You, you'd think, you know, you're paying a little bit, bit more that you'd like, you know, them to actually explore into more, more articulation, much like the um, Marvel Legends lines. Like even Hasbro have actually invested in giving people what they want. But anyhow, um, still decent figure, you know, great for articulation what you get for anyway and um, what you can do so hopefully they'll continue to try and impress us thank you very much for watching take care subscribe and um, we'll see you soon or you'll see me soon or this soon anyhow take care bye